This is a very brief uh, illustration of OA choice, uh, image choice in IIIF. Um, if we look at this uh, manuscript, we can see that it, the way it's been digitized, the um, images for the second and third canvas um, are actually of the same physical page. Um, and the effect that has had here is that the paging is thrown off because the recto and verso are now transposed because we don't have any metadata to tell us that actually these two images are really the same physical thing. Um, and in, in the IIIF model, there's really only one canvas here with two different images of it. So how can we correct this? If we go to the manifest as, as is, we can see that the canvases, yeah, we have two separate canvases in the second and third slots, two separate images. This is just saying these are two separate pages. So we can correct this by, instead of having these uh, DC types image annotations on the canvas, have instead, instead of those two canvases, replace those two canvases with one canvas where the annotation is not a DC types image directly, but an OA choice. And what OA choice gives us is the ability to specify a default image and then one or more alternate images. So in this case, I've specified the default image with that flap closed and then another one with the flap open. And what that means is that when we load this up somewhere that understands OA choice, we have the ability to turn on and off that um, choice of image while retaining the actual structure of the object. Uh, so here are if I just re reload this, our structure is intact. We don't, we no longer have two canvases in that slot. We just have one canvas. So the paging is correct. Uh, the book reads properly. Uh, and we can go back and forwards in the paging. And more importantly, the uh, options are available to us to show and hide that choice. Uh, we can have some more fun with this. Uh, this canvas here, or rather this manifest, is a single painting, so there's only one canvas. Uh, and here I'm annotating the canvas first of all with the full image, just as normal normal image, and then I'm annot adding another annotation, which is the choice. Now this canvas is uh, this painting by uh, Glindoni of uh, John Dee performing an experiment in front of Elizabeth I. And in my canvas I've added uh, the ability to specify who you want playing Elizabeth I. Uh, in this case you can choose between uh, Miranda Richardson or Glenda Jackson. And so this is an example where the it's not the whole image that's the choice, it's one of the details that's the choice. Uh, yes, 